Okay, so we are in a toy shop right now um, here in town. It's finally open this week. So I'm taking a look at what they have in shop. Some things are going to be marked down. I already got this, the birthday, the RSV, RSB Me Party. Oh, that's cool. So I already got that one and it was marked down. There's some flipping cute things, so cute. But a lot of them are marked down and I'm gonna have to come back next week, unfortunately, to pick them up. I really would like to get Gabe. He's super cute. My son is fixated on this ice cream van and we will have to wait and see. But there is a huge selection. There they are. Some things we already have. There is the stables, so. And the diner we have, but we don't have the bits and pieces. That's Jovi, I know. My daughter is like super excited. And when, as you could see, when my son was pointing out all the things and all the extra things up top. Yeah. So we're gonna have a quick look around here and then we'll be back next week to maybe pick up a few bits, new pieces. We'll see. The bowling alley. No touch. No touch. There is the, the chocolate stand. Hot chocolate stand. So cute. The lockers are new. The, oh, the pizza. The wood burning oven. Oh, it even has the noises too. Let's see. That is pretty cool. And the pizza. I need to get that table and chairs. The new Jeep, the off-roader has the thing in it too. Oh, there's just so many things. The picnic table I would like to get, but if I had a choice between the picnic table and that dining table, I don't know. Let me know in the comments what you think I should get. Hey, welcome back to my YouTube channel. and. I have to say that I've been doing a little bit more shopping. Um, as you can see in this video, you'll see that I've gone um, to one of our local toy stores. We have actually gone on a little bit of a family drive, um, going to explore some new places now that we're able to travel here in Ireland. And so while we were out, I ended up finding another toy store, which is actually the same um, company, just in a different location to see what um, they had in stock at their place because it was a little bit bigger. So let's get into this video and see what we found and do this quick little review. So what did we find at the Toy Star, are you wondering? Maybe you're not, I don't know. But if you've seen my videos, don't forget, if you haven't already, click the subscribe button. And if you like this video, don't forget to give a thumbs up. So. So the first one my daughter picked out, this one is Playtime Pets. So this one has the shoes, the shorts, the tea, and then their little fish bowl. And at the bottom, of course, because my daughter wanted it out, the fish bowl, and literally wanted the fish out. So she was very disappointed that she couldn't get the actual fish out of the tank. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna unbox that. So these are the fish food. Um, so there is the fish food there. If it'll zoom in. And then, then the fish formula. And I will get the fish bowl out because it's already out. So this is the cute little fish bowl. It's a little goldfish in there. So cute. It has a plastic melted up at the top. I'm assuming it's actually empty inside. It's not like an actual like jelly or whatever. Um, so it's just a plastic on top and the fish is actually glued to the bottom of the fish tank there by its fins. So my daughter was trying her hardest to try and take this out. So this is her favorite thing and it's so cute. So we'll be able to put that in the doll's house, probably on the table um, and we'll have it sitting there. I'm just gonna stick all the pieces up here for right now from each set. Um, so yeah, I have my scissors here to help me out. And yeah, so my daughter picked this one out. 
because I was looking at the ones that were marked down um, 10 euro and below. So, should pick up this one because it'll just all come out. So, comes with a cute pair of sandals. They're like the hard plastic. Has the little logo on the bottom. These are really sweet. It reminds me of something that I wore when I was younger. <laughs> so these ones are really cute sandal. Again, I'm gonna put them up here. So it also comes with an actual outfit. And I'll show in the end Lottie wearing this outfit. So I'll be able to do a video, uh, a screen at the end. So there's the shorts doesn't have actual pockets but it has the print on it that it is and then the back has a little strip of velcro there to be able to easily get it on so those ones are cute the little light denim so this one is a cute cute top I can't get over this top it's so cute um has little kitties on it and little gray bows on there on the necks that is so sweet so that and then it velcros all down the back there's two there so it velcros all down the back yeah so I'm gonna put that back there again I'll put this on her all right so that wasn't the only one that I got as a review I have actually been searching for a few of them and then when we had our lockdown um, since Christmas and our lockdown was finally lifted the second week in May. I don't even know what day it is anymore. Um, it is the weekend. I believe it's 20 something. Um, so yeah, I've looked for these little accessory sets and certain ones. And I really would like the camera one, um, the retro sets. Like, so I would really like the, um, the turntable. So I'd like to have the record player and records. I already have one record from one of her retro outfit studies she'd gotten. So again, we'd gotten spoiled. I'd gotten one and then he ended up buying me a couple more. So the one that I have really been looking for has been the typewriter. I have looked everywhere for this. And when I finally found one before Christmas or right around Christmas, that's when our lockdown happened. All right. So these are cute little stories that they've already typed up on the typewriter. Hopefully it's zooming in properly. That's not blurry. It comes with the two pens that went flying out of my hands. Really cute. The covers come off, make it look like you can write. It has the little tips on the end. Um, obviously they don't work, but, um, but they have... Oh, I'm gonna leave that up there. They have the glasses, which is another set of glasses. So cute. I love seeing little glasses on the dolls. Let's see how we can do it with our hair pulled up. Oh, that is so cute. Okay, I know it's not actually on her ears, but still. Okay, and on to the actual keyboard or the typewriter. Oh my gosh, keyboard. Um, the typewriter. So I'm gonna see. I could put a piece of paper in there. So I'm gonna have to make it look like, oh, oh, you can feed it through, okay. So it doesn't actually roll, um, the roller doesn't roll itself, but you're able to feed it through. I may have to do it this way. Um, it's just because the fact that it's all bent and whatnot, it won't actually slide in properly. So that is really cute. And then you just, Fold this over into the front because it's usually holding the pages um, in place. So that is so cute. The buttons, you can push the whole set. So the whole row will do it. And it moves over. And you slide it over. That is so adorable. I love this. So each row, not each key, but each row does the thing. And it makes this little thing jump up where you ink comes through so sweet. I'm gonna have to stick, I'm gonna have to make an office now. Like seriously, I'm gonna have to get to Ikea soon and make myself a little office soon. So I'm gonna put that up there. That was my main find that I really wanted to get, but there was obviously a few other bits and pieces that I wanted to get for that too. So now I'm just gonna whiz through 
and show you the bits and um, yeah, go from there. So the first one is let's do lunch. So this is the lunch bag. Um, my five-year-old decided that he liked this one a lot too when he was helping me narrow it down. So it has the lunch bag with little post-it notes. I'm not going to take them out just yet, but I'm going to keep them attached. I'm going to open this up because I will be able to open this. Ooh. Come on. There we go. Open that up. There's just, just tissue paper in there for right now. So we're going to stick the bits and pieces in here that we are getting. Oh, so cute. It's a little peachy pink color. I'm going to see if it actually opens up. Oh yeah, it does. It just screws off the top. So that is going in her lunch bag. She also has, or he, also has a yogurt. It's a little cup of yogurt. This one seems to be uh, cherry flavored. So that's going into the lunch bag. And then the last few bits are actually croissant that you can, oh, it's split apart. Okay. Um, so the croissant is, is actually split in half. So, and the cheese, cheese and the ham are shaped to be able to mold into the croissant. So you're able to make an actual sandwich. Now, if you wanted it to stay like this, I suppose you could glue it. Um, I need to turn that up around. I suppose you could glue it so that it doesn't move on you. Um, and then it would look like this all the time, but you could just use this. Maybe your doll doesn't want cheese or something. Um, so yeah, so that going in the lunch bag. That is a cute little set. I actually really like that one. So this is going over into the back. With the rest of the stuff. And the last one is called Happy Breakfast Set. So that is the last one here for the review. This one has orange juice, blueberry jam, it has a plate, a couple pieces of bread, and actually a weekly schedule. There is this cute little clock, which it actually does turn. There's a little dial on the back. So the time will change as of right now. It is likely after dinner because um, dinner is cooking right now. So I will just say quarter past five or half five. Um, so it comes with a, oh, they're together. Okay. They stay together. Good to know. Let's see if that actually lasts. So it comes with a plate, a knife, and two pieces of bread. Kind of looks like a baguette bread. Really cute. And then you would have your jam. Oops, take the tape off of that. And then you would have your blueberry jam to be able to place on there, on your bread, your toast. Um, so that's really cute. Plate. And then the last thing is your nice glass of OJ. So there's a nice little cup of orange juice for your breakfast, obviously plastic, but in a clear cup, it's really cute. So that one is a little bit different than the birthday party one. Um, so yeah, the last two things, and this will be quick, just because I, I know I'm running on. Um, the last two things was I found these cute little dresses, and of course these are way too big for my daughter. This is saying, in second hand shop, uh, seven to eight years old. I will be able to get a skirt and an actual dress 
possibly the same kind of look as this because it has like an off the shoulder um, t-shirt sh uh, sleeves up here, short sleeves, but it also has straps on your shoulders. So I may be able to make a miniature version of this um, for my daughter's dolls. So I'm going to do that. That's going actually in the wash first. And then I got this one the other day. This one's actually says uh, 13 to 14 years. It's a big shirt. It's cute. It has lots of polka dots. So I'll be able to, again, make a little summer dress like this, a little maxi dress. Or I can make a, uh, a t-shirt for the dolls. Uh, I can make like a little spring dress, uh, skirt. So yeah, I'll be able to do different things with the more fabric, bigger sizes that I get. I just like the prints on these. So that is the end of this video. If you liked it, please give a thumbs up and I will see you in the next video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye guys.